this lesson is about schedules and perhaps an unknown aspect of schedules in Revit architecture that allows you to associate an image with a particular scheduled element in the model. For example, a furniture schedule. You can look this up and learn it at uh, Autodesk. There's a um, little segment about creating schedules with images, but I will demonstrate how it works. So I'm going to open the work in progress. It has a furniture schedule in it. Uh, let's go to one of the sheets. Schedules. Uh, Z enter just to center. So there we have a furniture schedule here. Table, coffee table, shelving, etc., etc. Right. I'm going to modify this schedule. Double click. It's just so that we can display the property. So I'm going to add a field to it. And I'm going to scroll down from the available fields and select image. And add it. Actually, I'm going to move it up to the front. So we'll have it right in front. So images here. Um, what this allows you to do is select images that are in the model already. These are saved renderings. So let's say this conference room perspective uh, was, a, was an appropriate image to, to display the, um, this uh, Herman Miller table. Let me see what else I have in here. I don't think I have much else saved as images. Uh, so let's find that table. It's this class top table. Verdict. Well, there are two of them. There's one in each conference. So I could go down to that perspective view. Right? And then when I go back to my schedule, that table is listed here. So th it's a way to schedule your furniture selections, your material selections, uh, associated them with an image. So as you're 3D modeling, you can also um, add um, schedules uh, some of the documentation that you'll need for your project, for your project presentation. You can also import images. Let's say uh, this Breuer chair, four of which are included somewhere in the mo model. So I could go to the internet and find Boyer chair, an image for any one of them. This is one of the ones typical with Revit, but let's let's select it. the Wassily image. I'm going to oops, save this image somewhere where I can find it. Documents, that's fine. So if I go back to Revit, Um, probably need a view where it's appropriate to import that. Let's do it here for a moment. Insert image. Go to my um, documents. And 
And there's that lawyer chair. I'm arbitrarily placing it now, right? So it's in the model somewhere. But having done that, we now can modify this oops, schedule and find the Breuer chair that we placed. So I'm going to send this uh, and then, yeah, go back there. So uh, it's just a little messy right now, but you get the general idea. This is a very useful feature that few people know about. I'm going to send this to the Revit uh, roundtable and thesis students that are working with it. Circulate it to your friends. Cheers.